Sea level rise is something we really all have to worry about, and Miami City leaders are now considering a plan to keep one historic park high and dry. Local 10's Christina Vasquez is joining us live to explain how. And the City of Miami resiliency plan for this park, one city commissioner hopes that it could be a model for other parks just like it. Morningside, one of Miami's most historic neighborhoods, with many homes here built in the 1920s, now facing a 2020s modern era issue. Its park routinely floods. Not only during king tides, flooding on Morningside Park has been a problem for a long time. And as we know, because of climate change impact, it's getting worse. The city of Miami moving forward with a multi-million dollar plan to mitigate against the impact of rising seas here. It's moving to a future. What they are trying to present here is a model that could be used for other parks that look like Morningside Park. Our e agenda has passed. <laughs> Commissioners yesterday approving a resolution to apply for more than $4 million in grant funding, with Commissioner Sabino Covo's office explaining will be matched by the city. Keep the existing mangroves. It calls for drainage improvements, elevation of a bay walk by two feet, plus a seawall set back from the living shoreline. When you hear seawall, this might be what you are envisioning, a more traditional setup right against the coastline. Commissioner Covo says what makes this project a bit unique is that the seawall at Morningside Park will be set inland. The novelty of this plan is that it has a seawall inland. But because of the elevation, the residents are still and the visitors are still going to be able to enjoy the access to the water. And she went on to say that really a focus here is maintaining and putting a highlight on a living shoreline idea to resiliency at this park. We have so much more for you on local10.com. There on our website, we have a full budget breakdown. You can also see artistic renderings of this project. This is phase one of this plan. Reporting live for you, I'm Christina Vasquez, Local 10 News. All right, Christina, thank you.